Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. This is Winter Phoenix, and today we are going to play my favorite Harvest Moon Animal Parade. I think I like this one because all the different animals, the storyline, the graphics, there's so much to see and do. Turn the volume up just a little bit so we can actually hear the music. And hopefully, it doesn't get all glitchy on us either. Oh, yeah, that was fine. I'm going to play as a boy on this one. I usually play as a boy on this one um, because I like the marriage candidates. Glowy ball flying at me. It's a fairy. Hey, don't forget that we have to go see the harvest goddess. I have a feeling she needs our help. And you're the only one who can see me. Does that mean you're a figment of my imagination? Oh, hey, uh, what was your name again? I'm going to name our character Winter. After Winter Phoenix. Yep. That'll do. Ah, oh, that's right, Winter. I'm Kane, the owner of Horn Ranch. Nice to meet you. It's only a little longer to your house. Would you mind if I asked you a few questions about yourself until we got there? It's just that it's so unusual for young people to want to start up a ranch these days. Well, let me start with this. What's your favorite food? I'm just going to put vegetables and fruit. I think it affects how much you recover when you eat it. And those are the easiest things for us to get. I see. And when's your birthday? I'll put summer. I'm late. Gotcha. Anyway, like I was saying, there aren't a lot of ranchers now. I hope that you'll be able to re reinvigorate the town. However, this place has seen better days. Looks lush and green to me. We haven't had any good crops in a while. No one seems to know why. Have you watered them? Hey, Winter, I know you're excited about finally getting your ranch. Remember that we have to go see the Harvest Goddess as soon as we get there, though. Okay. Hey, are you even listening to me? Nope, I'm enjoying my hay cart ride. Ugh, it's gonna get all glitchy anyway. Finn's flying around me. I'm gonna run up to my house. I've got holes in the roof. I don't know how I'm gonna sleep in there. Get rainwater in my bed. Finn is going to fly around me in excitement and get in my face. Oh, uh, this ranch is pretty beat up. You think? Hello, hello. Hello, you must be winter. Welcome to Harmonica Town. I'm Mayor Hamilton. Why don't I explain the basics about your ranch? It may look a bit rusty, but with just a little care, it'll look fabulous in no time. I can see right through my roof. Behind you is your plot. Wow, this is great, Winter. You get a house and land for free. What a town. Oh, 
Oh, I nearly forgot. You can make the $5,000 payment for your new land at Town Hall. There's no due date. You can pay at any time. Well, I guess it was too good to be true. Oh, and I have this for you. It's a map of the surrounding land, and I'm sure it will be helpful to get you situated. Got map! And I have this for you, too. You'll need this to start a ranch. Got farming starter set. You'll find flute fields over there. There's a farm and a ranch, so they can help you if you have questions. Also, opposite flute fields is Harmonica Town. Head this way to get to the Gorman Mines. Garmin? Gorman? I'm going to call it Garmin. I've also left you some helpful books on your bookshelf. In your bookshelf? If you're not sure about something, take a look. It's likely in a book. That rhymed. Well, I'll be heading back to Town Hall. Once you're ready, stop by the town. Thanks for running all the way out here to meet me. I appreciate it. Well, let's start by naming the ranch. I'm going with our traditional moon drop. Yep, that's a good name. Moon drop ranch. That's a great name. I know. We can find the Harvest Goddess in the Garmin Mine area. The path to the northwest should lead us there. Alright, now let's hurry up and see the Harvest Goddess. Hey, Winter, you're not listening again. No, I want to check out my new house. Just bear with me. I know the sound is terrible. It's kind of glitchy, but that's just how the Wii is. That's the bookshelf Mayor Hamilton was talking about. You should take a look. You can save your game at the bedside table. Save your game often. If you have any questions, press the number one button to talk to me. Ouch. I'm not reading all that. Sorry, guys. It's all the stuff that was added to the bookshelf. I'm just going to save. I'm not going to bed. I do have another save file. It's mine. Don't look at it. There we are, guys. Okay. So we're going to go tend to our field over here. So we got us some nice flowers. Got to get the watering can equipped here. Might help if we filled the watering can up first. I don't know, though. Just a guess. Hey, looky there. Those have to be full. So the first place I'm going to go is to the ranch... 
I have my reasonings. Then we'll go to town and meet people. And I will kind of tell you about the pets. Okay, let's put that away. Oh, I forgot we have some more over here. But, I'm going to harvest these. And we're going to sell them. Four monies. Yeah, the music's always chalky, and a lot of the times the picture picture's really chalky. It's just, that's just how the Wii is, like I said, so I apologize if it's slow and choppy. I have to deal with it too. But it's an amazing game, so hang in there with me. And he's at five, six... We have nine uh, turnips in our backpack. I think that's nine. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. That's fine. Because um, that reminds me over here, we're going to get some grass today. I have my reasonings. At least four. Um, let's see, we have one here, so we're gonna need another ten. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. By my reasonings, don't judge. Now we will go to the ranch and the seed place, and I will tell you why. Well, actually I won't. The game will tell you why. Um, another Harvest Moon that I know about that I haven't really played is Tree of Tranquility. Um, I played maybe one day on it. <laughs> It's just, I don't know, it's boring and dull. I can't get into that one. And then I've tried all the um, the Sunshine Islands and, and all that, and they're quite dull too. I don't know, I've played them. I think I played a whole month in those ones though, but yeah, the ones, the one that I haven't been able to play more than a day in is the Tree of Tranquility. I just, for some odd reason, cannot get into that Harvest Moon. Sorry about that, guys. Sorry, guys. I just paused for a second because my, my family had questions. Okay, so this over here is one of the animals you can adopt. It's a squirrel. So, like, as you friend animals, you can become their friend and adopt them. And I'm also kind of foraging. Okay, here's another animal. It's a little boar. A little baby boar. Here's Horn Ranch. Come on, let's go, winner. Quinn's like always excited to go meet people and see things. Okay, here's the boar. Little baby boar. Makes such a cute noise. Okay, we're gonna go in here and meet people.
The graphics that went into this game, look at that. Just fully detailed shelf stock, like a real supermarket would be. It's just amazing. Sigh. Oh, hello there. Oh, are you the new person my husband said was starting up a ranch? Uh-huh. I see I wish you luck, but you should know things here have been pretty rough lately. It's been tough. We only have a few animals to sell. My husband might have already told you this, but the wind has been very weak lately. There's not a lot of wind to power the big windmill. It's hard to even make animal feed. Hmm. It's a real dilemma. Oh dear me. I've done nothing but complain since we've met. I need to cheer up. A um, winner, was it? Good luck to you. Here, take this. You'll need a sickle on your ranch. Use it on grass to collect fodder for your animals. Got sickle! I'm Hannah. I've been working on this ranch for years. If you have any questions, just come ask me. Okay, I gotta buy some things from you. So, we're gonna need a milk. And it has to be... Let me turn my do not disturb on. This is getting annoying. I'm sorry, guys. A decent milk. It cannot be hot milk. It does not count. Okay. One of those. Oh, that's a decent wool. I was like, oh my goodness. Okay, one decent milk. And we're going to need a couple fodders. At least four until our grass start growing. You'll want these in advance for a reason. Okay, and then her husband's over here. We're going to go meet him. He's in the field. I can't show you with the screen being black. Okay, so this is their daughter. She is a marriage candidate. Sheesh. I haven't seen you before. Oh, my dad told me about you. You must be Winter. Our animals have been so lethargic lately, they used to be so much more active. It's hard to get them to leave the barn now. I am so sorry, I shouldn't complain in front of someone I just met. I should introduce myself. My name is Renee. I live here on this ranch. A ranch is a lot of work, but it's really rewarding. Let us know if you need any help, and good luck. So yeah, leave a post in the comments about who I should marry. I'll try to let you know who all of them are. And this is their dad, Kane. Hey, he's the one that drove us in here. How are you doing? Got a good farm going yet? Yeah, in one day. A couple hours. Okay, so we're coming in here. We're going to check out their poor, sick animals. Hey, Winner, how are you finding ranching? It's a lot of work, huh? Most people don't realize how hard it is before they try it. Say, how would you like a calf? 
For real? Your first calf is a big step as a rancher. When your calf grows up, it will produce milk. And if you become friends with it, you can even ride it. Please give me the calf. Alright, which cow do you want? We'll go with this cow. Alright, here you go. You have to name it, though. Will? What kind of a cow's name is Will? I'm going traditional. Bessie. Yep. It's a good cow's name. She's excited about it. Look how static she is. I know you'll take good care of her. And if you have any questions, just come and ask me. Here, I'll give you this. If you brush your animals every day, you'll become much closer to them. You got a brush and a calf. Take good care of her now. I will. She's smaller than me. Brush was added to your help menu. I actually like the horses too. I like their feet. Their feet. Oh, look at the goat. And the sheeps. Oh, they're so cute. Wow. And then like all of a sudden his cows are full grown. They grew up quick. Okay, now we need grass seeds and I'm sure you guys know why now. Can't befriend the birdies, unfortunately. I would hate to have these people as neighbors. Here's Maroomba Farm. Let's check it out, winner. It's another very well detailed shop stocked with their shelves. I wish I had, like, a real place like this. I'd go shopping there. Oh, yeah? Well, I'll leave and never come back. See if I care, you good-for-nothing son. Man, rude. Look who's talking at least make an effort to work. And you wonder why Anissa hasn't come back. She's one of another marriage candidate's Anissa's. It doesn't matter. Nothing will grow here no matter what we do. The Harvest Goddess has abandoned us. Are you the new rancher I've heard about? We sell seeds here, but we don't have the same stock we used to. Hey, you're the newcomer, right? What's your name? Winter. Winter, huh? I'm Taylor. Nice to meet you. The ones fighting in there are my dad, Craig, and my mom, Ruth. The soil is pretty lousy these days. It's tough to grow decent crops. My dad's been pretty depressed over it. That's why I'm thinking of going off to buy seeds. My big sister, Anissa, left to find seeds that will grow here. But she's still not back. So I'm gonna go see if there's anything I can do. The world is huge, kid. Thanks, I appreciate the support. 
Here, take these. There are some seeds I've been holding on to. Got cabbage seeds, and I'm really sorry about the uh, music. That's just how it is. You may not get great results at first, but I think the soil will improve the more you plant in it. Well, good luck. See you around. Yeah, whenever there's cutscenes, like, the music will get really crappy. The game will get really laggy. Are these the load screens aren't terrible. We need to get, um, grass seeds. Yes. And then we also... Need to get one decent strawberry. No comment. I'm not telling you why I did that. Nope. Mm -mm. You will have to watch the next episode to find out. Yep. Why did I buy a decent strawberry? Comment below if you know. If not, just watch the next episode. One more person to meet. And another animer. An animal. Animer. Whatever. Water wheel's just barely dripping with water. It's not throwing water around like it should be. The prize is still running. Why, hello, you must be the newcomer. My name is Toby. You may have already heard about this, but things are pretty grim in this town. The land has just become lifeless. This river used to be way stronger. The water wheel barely moves now. That's what I was just commenting on. Sigh. I'm sorry if you hear being in the background. My husband's working on our house. We're building a house. The fishing's not great right now, but it's still fun to fish. This is my old fishing pole. Give it a try sometime. I would love to fish. Received an old fishing pole and a beginner's fishing book. Happy fishing. Here it is. This is the other animal. It's a rabbit. Yeah, there's a bunch of different animals that um, you can friend as a pet and then they... Once they're a certain heart level, they'll come home with you. So, um, you guys can also comment in the below. Um, if you guys have a specific animal you want to try to friend, um, I will try to meet them all, and then we can decide. Um, so, any of the next couple episodes, after seeing one, if you like one, just comment below. Okay, so we're going to go to town and meet the rest of the people. It's going to be really late when we get home. Um, and then we'll take care of our cow, plant our crops. Ah, oh, dang, I did not buy the other seeds we needed. Oof. That's okay, we didn't have a lot of money left anyway. Um, and we don't have to do that immediately. Um, I just like to be ahead. Um... I want to progress on the main storyline. So the part that's going to be a drag is the fifth bell in order for us to get it. 
we're going to have to fr uh, friend all of the townspeople. And it is really slow to do. So, but, um, I don't know. Anytime I see Let's Plays, I don't like people, like, skipping out on stuff. That bothers me. So, I'm going to drag you guys through it all. Because then I'm like, well, what I, what did I miss? You know, did anything exciting happen in between while you were giving gifts to people? Like, that really bothers me when they, like, skip. Okay, that was it for those seeds. Cabbage seeds, we'll have nine of these. I'm going to put them down here. Okay, so those are the seeds we started with and the seeds that that little kid gave us. I don't remember his name. Um, the one that wanted to go after his sister, Anissa. I should have grass seeds too. Yep. Okay. These are for Bessie. So she can come out and eat when they're fully grown. Okay, I think that was it for seeds. No. Sorry, I was worried. I had the strawberry in my hand. Okay, let me see here. I don't know why I keep selecting that. Like, I don't... I keep hitting the over button, and for some odd reason, it just keeps selecting it. Fishing rod... Okay, let's go brush our cow and feed her, um, and then we'll go to town and meet peoples. Yes, Bessie, I see that you're hungry. she can eat from there. I don't think she can. Yeah, see? May have wasted that one fodder, but we'll see. I don't know why you can place it there if it doesn't feed her. Okay, so we're going to go to town and meet the rest of the people. I know it's getting late. Um, there's 24 hours in a day, so we still have 8 hours left on the game. Um, I don't know when the shops close, but I don't think they close till late either, so I think we're okay. Because in my test run, I know I went to the, the farm and the seed shop late, so... Hopefully we can go to town and see the town shops late. Harmonica Town. That looks like the town hall winner. I 
Maybe you should go see Mayor Hamilton. Hmm. I thought it was closed. We just read the sign. I seen it said 1700 and I saw it was 1630. I was like, oh. Welcome! You must be the newcomer. It's always nice to see a young new face in town. A ranch, huh? Well, good luck. My name is Simon. I've been running this photo studio for the past 15 years. There are lots of great views around this town. I can give you a tour sometime if you'd like. Oh, as a welcome present, I'll give you my old camera. Sorry guys, give me a second, I gotta turn my heater off. There. Okay. Got an old camera. You can take portraits here too, so come again. I don't think this stuff's too rough. Like the graphics and the doesn't run too bad. The music's terrible though. Doesn't look like a mayor's office. Winter, I've been waiting for you. Welcome. This is Harmonica Towns Hall. You can buy land plots here. Why don't you go introduce yourself to everyone in town and come back when you're done? Don't forget to visit the church on top of the hill. Okay. You have to tell them to stay open so I can do it. It is kind of late in the day. Sonata Tailoring. Looks like a nice clothing shop too. Man, they've done really well in these shop stocks and stuff. What should we do? We barely have anything to sell. I don't know. Oh my, I thought our sign said closed. I'm sorry, we're not open yet. Oh, I see. Meeting everyone, eh? I'm Shelly. This is my granddaughter, Candace. Candace is also a marriage candidate. It's nice to meet you. We'll start this tailoring shop, but we're almost out of materials for clothes. If only Luna were here. But Luna, she still has her studies. Luna's her sister. Uh, Luna is Candace's sister. I know, but we can't satisfy our customers if this is all we have. They're out of wool. For cloth. I'm sure wool and yarn will be sold in the markets again soon. So we're going to have to do our part and buy a sheep and sell wool and yarn. I hope so. Oh, I'm sorry. I didn't mean for you to hear our venting. We'll be open soon. We don't have much, but come on by and take a look. Okay.
She is also a marriage candidate. Hello, I don't think we've met. Are you the newcomer? Yep. Well, Winter, nice to meet you. The bar's closed right now, but how about some tea? Looks like a real bar, too, with all the bottles on the shelf over there. He's got his rag. He's cleaning the cup. Is this a visitor? Yeah, Winter is in town to start a ranch. I thought I'd at least offer Winter a cup of tea for coming all this way. We're pretty much out of supplies for drinks here. The ship isn't sailing, so we can't restock. It's like the whole town is slowly withering. I've heard rumors that the goddess tree is dying. Yes, and the water and the wind seem so lifeless. What can we do? Well, we still have to find a way to go on. I'm Kathy, and that's my father, Hayden. I own the bar. Nice to meet you. We may not have any cocktails to serve, but come on by when you're free. You're always welcome. Thank you. little glitchy there. The fishery. It looks interesting too. Welcome, although there's not much to sell you. What, you're not here to buy any fish? Oh, I see, you're that new rancher. I'm the fisherman, Ozzy. The fish around here are usually tasty and plentiful. But ever since the light in the lighthouse went out, no ships have been able to sail, so I can barely get any fish. It's made business pretty rough. If that lighthouse doesn't get fixed soon, I'll be out of business. I don't know what's wrong with the town these days. Hmm. Where are Toby and Palo? They're my son and nephew. Toby's over by the river. Maybe they're over by the flute field's water mill. I'm sure they'll just, they're will just they just as sad about this miserable fishing situation. Sorry to be so grim. I just wish I had good fish to offer you. Here, at least take these. They're good grilled. Three char. Ah, well, am I? What am I going to do? It will be okay. Ships can't make it into port. It's getting harder and harder on the inn. I know, honey. What should we do? Hmm. Hello. I don't think I've seen you around here before. Nope, I'm new. First day here. Oh, you're the new rancher the mayor was talking about. Nice to meet you. 
I'm Jake. You can find me at the Ocarina Inn. Feel free to come and visit. That's the Ocarina Inn. I'm Colleen. Nice to meet you. I know the town is lacking in energy right now. But it's nice to see someone young move here. Well, good luck, winner. Thank you. Good luck to you guys, too. I will conquer this farm. Okay, this is their inn, but we don't need to go in. And this is the doctor's office. Coral Clinic. I haven't seen you before. What's wrong? Do you need to see the doctor? Nope. Oh, you're the new rancher. I'm Irene. Nice to meet you. What? I look worried. Well, aren't you observant? There's a lot on my mind right now. Well, I'd hate to bother you with our problems already. But do you know of the goddess tree? Nope. It's a divine tree that grows at the goddess spring where the harvest goddess lives. That tree protects this land. Lately, that tree has looked like it's dying. And it's said that the tree is a part of the harvest goddess herself. That's true, the harvest goddess is really worried. Oh, I should tell you, my grandson, Dr. Jin, is away studying medicine right now. Be careful not to get sick or hurt yourself. There's only so much I can do for you without him. Well, take care. It's because she's not a doctor. That's what I was just about to ask you. Okay, there's another doggy up here. We're almost done meeting people. There's two more places we gotta go. Um, this doggy can also be a pet. It's a little collie. Church grounds. You can see the Garmin Mine District behind the church. We're gonna go there tomorrow. Sorry about all the noise. Um, I'm in a small room and my kiddo's in here with me, so I'm sure you'll hear him from time to time. So this is a dog. This is a Pyrenees. It's another animal that you can friend or keep. And this little kitty is also another adoptable cat. Um, that's the one I normally get is that little black cat. Alright, here's another person we had to meet. I think his name's Chance. <sighs> um, I don't think we've met. You must be the new rancher everyone is talking about.
Running a ranch on your own, that sounds tough. Good luck. I'm the bar's cook, but we can't get ingredients or customers for that matter. Without a good cooking fire, I can't cook anything decent anyway. What a joke. Anyway, I guess I should introduce myself. I'm Chase. I'm a cook at the Brass Bar. His name's Chase, not Chance. The bar's open, but we're not serving any food right now. Once we start serving food again, you should come by. Okay. All right, and the last set of people we got to meet, and then we'll go water our crops and call it a day. This episode's kind of long, too. Celesta Church. This is Myra. Here for comfort again today? Yes, I've already been a year since I lost him. Sometimes it seems like a long time ago. Sometimes like it was only yesterday. Nice to meet you. You must be the rancher the mayor was talking about. I'm Perry. I'm a priest in training. I should go. Take care. That was Myra. She lost her husband about a year ago. She was absolutely heartbroken. She's a little better now, though. She still doesn't really know what to do with herself, though. I wish I could be more helpful, but I still have a lot to learn. If you see her, please try talking to her. You may have better luck. A newbie in town, better luck than a person who knows her better. Okay, if you say so. So, Finn has not told us that we met everybody, which means we didn't meet everybody. We can go talk to the mayor. The mayor will tell us who we missed. Because Finn will be like, oh, hey, we met everybody. And he did not do that. It's locked, so it's getting late, so we'll just go water our crops and we'll try to figure it out tomorrow. I don't know who else that would be. really lagging, so we're going really slow. So we're going to sell those fish that the fishermen gave us, Ozzy. Just trying to get my watering can here.
The good news is we're going to have a whole bunch of props to sell, so we'll have quite a bit of money here pretty soon. We need money for things. Yep, things. I don't know if you need to water the grass in this one, um, so I'm going to do it anyway. Because in some harvest moons you have to water crops, and in other harvest moons you don't, and it's kind of all up in the air. So I'm just going to water it just to make sure, because Bessie needs her grass. Yep. Poor little Bessie needs her grass. I think you do. I think you do have to wire it in this one. Okay, well that's it for this episode, guys. If you like my videos and you want to see more, please like and subscribe. A um, couple comments down below. We need to know who we're marrying. We need to know who our pet is. And um, if anybody wants to comment on why I bought a decent strawberry, they can comment below. Alright, you guys have a great day, and I'll see you guys soon.